We're gathered here uh, together. We're going to walk upstairs to Chris Van Hollen's Rockville uh, office. And we are about to deliver petitions asking for the Super Committee to be more transparent, to have uh, more open meetings. Regular Pennsylvanians to send Senator Toomey a message that they want to know who he's meeting with while he's making these decisions on the Super Committee. We live in a country that's a democracy, and a democracy uh, depends on a, an informed electorate. We have a situation where, you know, 12 representatives and senators are making decisions about the future of things like the Medicaid and Medicare programs that benefit millions of Americans, and they're not talking about who they're meeting with. People who may potentially want to privatize healthcare services, privatize Social Security, they're not revealing their campaign contributions. I'm a member of many organizations, all of which uh, need to have information about public expenditures, public and tax money. And we're particularly uh, distressed by the amount of money that weapons manufacturers provide to members of Congress. So we are here with Sunlight Foundation and 40 other national groups, and we're all here because we care about transparency. Um, so we have um, the, the five points of transparency that we're asking the, um, the congressmen to adhere to, and then also the reasons why that we personally care about them. I want a, a decent future for my grandchildren. These are uh, made by my granddaughters for me. And um, I think they're going to have a very difficult life if we continue on the path we're, we're going on. It's a difficult time for a lot of Americans right now. Unemployment is very high. Um, and, you know, people are really struggling. And it's very difficult for people to know that their interests are being represented when they're not in the room and, you know, the, the members of the sewer committee are not really telling folks what those conversations are that are happening. It's about time that we shed some light on what's going on in the process and bring the people in. We have had a few visitors at our Hyattsville office also, and so we're sending that on to the congressman too so that he knows and he hears you. We would like to see some change, some action. Yeah.